Hey everybody, what's going on? Speedy Diver here, and this is night 764 of GameStop Dumpster Diving, and I'm hoping tonight's gonna be a good one, because we have three bags, which means three times the odds. Now, with that being out of the way and all of that said, one thing I want to let you guys know, which I actually announced yesterday, in yesterday's video, I'm doing a brand new giveaway. Yes, for anyone who missed it in yesterday's video or didn't get to watch yesterday's video, I announced a brand new giveaway, which the one winner can win either an Xbox One, a PS4, or a Nintendo Switch. Now, I did have a giveaway very similar to this one last month, I believe, and the winner actually chose a Nintendo Switch. So, make sure if you guys want to enter, I will tell you all the entries into the giveaway, basically, you have to stay very active on the channel by liking all the videos, commenting, uh, make sure you guys comment, make sure you guys like, make sure you subscribe, you have to be a subscriber, I will know if you're a subscriber or not, so make sure you do that, <laughs> and also make sure you guys click the little bell, that way you get notifications every day I post a brand new video, as well as follow me on Instagram and Twitter, those are also great ways for you guys to see when I post videos, because on Twitter, I do tweet every time I post a brand new video, and that's an entry, and also, when you guys follow me on Instagram, I post a ton of pictures on there, so make sure you guys do all those, now, now, I'm not going to tell you guys how I'm going to pick the winner yet, but when the time comes, I will. Now, with all that out of the way, make sure you guys enjoy the video. Actually, I hope you guys enjoy it, so let's just get into it. Let's rip into these bags, the three mystery bags. First things first is we're going to do the weight test. Bag number one. Eh. Bag number two, it looks really airy, not too light. Bag number three. Mm, wait, which one's heavier? I'm going to be honest, guys. They're all about the same weight, even though this one's the smallest, that's the medium size, and that's the largest. They're all about the same weight. This one I think maybe could be a little bit heavier, so let's get into this one first, and then let's get into, I think, this one, then that one. Let's just rip into it. Okay. First thing I'm seeing is a couple cans. Throw those over there. Come on, baby. Ooh, we got a rubber band. Rubber band squad. Ooh, that stung a little bit. Another can as well. We got a box in here. We have a box. Really big box. Kind of heavy for an Xbox. No way. Oh. Oh, it sounds like something's in there. This is an Xbox One Elite controller box. Now these boxes are heavy to begin with because they're super thick boxes and they're made very well, but it definitely sounds like there's something in there and it kind of feels like something's rattling around. Oh, I'm excited. Now it looks like, yeah, it has been opened already. That's where the stickers would have been. Oh, I'm so excited. <laughs> let's get into it. Come on, let's pop it open. Also, by the way, the giveaway is going to be ending July 19th or the 20th around that like time period around those days so make sure if you guys want to enter the giveaway you guys stay active on the channel that's why I said stay active because I'm um, yeah that's just mm, that's all I'm going to give away for now so make sure you guys do those all those entries to be entered into the giveaway I can't open this with one hand okay putting the camera down let's get it guys let's get it I'll get it Ooh, a little bit here we go let's see is there anything inside though that is the question oh no no, it is still, ooh, is there something in here? No, it's, it looked like there was. A little bit of an illusion there with the little shaders, I guess. But uh, Elite Controller Box. Sadly, nothing on the top, but I see an Xbox logo in the bottom, which is okay. Okay, we got some pamphlets, maybe some Xbox Live Gold or something in here. Who knows? Okay. It looks like that's it. Does this come out? I have no idea. I've never actually owned one of these, so I don't know. But no, it's not. It's very thick, though. Very thick box. Super heavy. Um, I think these are just regular pamphlets. I'm trying to look for codes, if there's any codes. I love giving away codes to you guys, and I don't think so. Nope. No codes. Just a bunch of pamphlets and whatnot. But it's still a really, really cool box, and I think I'm going to keep it. I like boxes, to be honest, that like you can like just like do this, like the whole up and down. Kind of thing. I don't know. I just think it's really cool. It's a really rock solid box. It sounds like someone's knocking on the front door <laughs> because it's like that. That is actually a nice box. Sadly, nothing inside. Let's get back in here. Uh, damn, that is. Mm, I thought maybe something, maybe a pair of batteries, anything. No games in there. Got another rubber band here as well. I'll take that. Bunch of garbage. Ton of garbage in this one. Trying to look around. Now they were, all these bags were like on the lighter side, but we have three bags, so that's three times the odds. We have a gift card, I'll take that. 
not the garbage. Throw that over there. And I hope everybody is super excited for this giveaway because I am really, really excited. All I've been thinking about for like the past like day now is just the giveaway because I, I love giving stuff away and I think that is so awesome. So uh, let's, I don't think anything else is in this bag to be honest. Let's go to bag number two and see what's up. Oh, oh baby, bag number two. That is where it's at, what? I'm actually shaking. I'm literally shaking right now. Oh, what? How is this the same way? Oh, I guess because I box is so heavy. Oh, there's so many cases. That's beyond ridiculous. Look at all those PS4 cases. There's at least four, five cases that are PS4. Holy crap. This is beyond words right now. This, what? Oh, mmm. Ooh, take it in. Just take it in. <laughs> the smell of games <laughs> from the garbage. That sounds pretty gross, but you know, gift card, gonna keep it. Let's get into the first one and make our way down the ladder of games. Call of Duty Black Ops 4. Fingers crossed, everybody. Please be in here. And this feels like a brand new case. Ooh. Oh, no. Oh, heart is broken. My heart sank into my butt. The quote from the Speedy Diver. <laughs> Whenever I say my heart sinks in my butt, you guys always make the funniest comments in the comment section. You guys are like, quote from the Speedy Diver, 2019. My heart sank in my butt. <laughs> like, nobody says that but me. Like, I've heard other people say it before, but I'll take credit for it. I mean, <laughs> sadly, no game and no manual, but a decent looking nice. It actually feels like brand new. It feels like a brand new game that was just opened. This one, Tomb Raider. <sighs> oh, wait. Oh. It's not a case. It's a sleeve that goes over the game. Ooh, a limited steel book edition for Shadow of the Tomb Raider. So a steel book would have been in this. That is awesome. I've actually found this game before. No joke for the Xbox One. And this game's still relatively new. So that is freaking crazy. Sadly, not the Xbox One version of the steel book uh, sleeve thing. It's the PS4 one. But, oh, that's, is that the steel book? That is dope. Oh, this game, by the way, is really, really good. I played a little bit of it, the one that I found, and it's really good. I want to get the steel book. I'm going to find that now. That's cool. Next game, Assassin's Creed Origins. Oh, no, another empty case. This one did have a dummy sleeve, though, so that's kind of stinky, but oh, come on, baby. Come on. <coughs> Red Dead Redemption 2 as I'm choking. Red Dead 2. Let's get it, baby. Oh, no. Oh, ooh. is that the map? No way. Oh, it's the map, though. So, oh, no, it's broken, too. The case is actually broken, sadly, so no game can actually fit in that. Oh, it's all cracked up. It's all cracked. So that is sadly broken, the case, but the freaking map. The map. Oh, that is so awesome. I'm putting the camera down. We got to look at this. This is cool. Oh, no way. That is awesome. I love games that like put maps in, especially Rockstar games like uh, Grand Theft Auto. They put a map in it. This one, New Austin. That is cool. That is a really cool map. It's double sided as well, which is even cooler. This is the other side. It says New Hanover. That is freaking dope. I like that a lot. I love maps. So I think that's really cool, especially like Skyrim and stuff. Those games. Ooh, maps just make games feel so much better when you buy them. It, like it actually feels like you're paying for something more than just a game. You're paying for something that like it's really cool. You can put it on the wall. You can frame it up. That is freaking awesome. Putting that bad boy. Just going to slide it in there for now. That's an epic find. Let's see what else we have. NBA 2K18. Let's get it. Ooh. Ooh. This game smells weird. Like, right when I lifted the game out, I went, ooh, because it smells weird. I had a whiff of something weird. Is this a game? As I smell the case, oh, that smells foul. I don't even want to touch it. Um, I don't know what that smells like, but probably not going to keep that case. <laughs> I don't know. It's a pretty new game, too. It smells really, really bad. I uh, don't know what's up with that. Does this one smell bad? No, this one smells fine. I think it's just that case. Uh, either way, Lego Star Wars. The Force Awakens. Oh, is the game... Oh, I don't think it is, but that's the manual. And no game. It's missing clips. That is a first for me. I don't think I've ever found a case with two missing clips. But the manual's in there, so it's a halfway decent case. Not too, too bad. And last but not least, Ghost Recon Future Soldier. And it's not in there. Oh... 
come on, what's going on? I've been hitting jackpots like crazy the past like three months. And now all of a sudden, not finding as much stuff. So it's kind of disappointing. But it is what it is. It's dumpster diving. You don't know what you're going to find, where you're going to find it, or when. But uh, tonight, I mean, hey, still cases are still really good to find. So I'm not too disappointed. It's still something. To find something makes it a good night. So a bunch of gift cards in this one. This one's got sticky stuff on it, so I'm not going to keep that. But another gift card. That one's stuck on there. Anything else in here? Let's check it out. As I say, is there anything else? I see a legit quarter. Oh yeah, that is a quarter. What? See, this is why I always say go to the bottom of the bag. It's like I always go to the bottom of the bag because you don't know what you're going to find. A 1972 quarter, 25 cents richer. Look at that. Ooh, that's nice. I'm going to lose it, so I'm going to put it there. <laughs> that was sweet. It was just chilling right there. That's why you always go on the bottom of the bag. I find so... I used to find a lot of change. Not so much anymore, but uh, I do still find change time to time. So, I mean, 25 cents. Hey, that's, that's something. It's, it adds up. Once you find enough change, you can mm, have a lot. <laughs> Here we go. Let's get into the last and final bag. Let's check it out. Ooh, I'm instantly liking it because I see a GameStop bag in here. That's light. Oh, no, there's something in there. What do we have? Batteries. Oh, I thought it was a brand new pack of batteries. These might still be good, though. Why is just... There's literally just two... Ba I'm going to keep them. <laughs> literally just two batteries chilling in this bag. Anything else? No, that's it. Well, it's a GameStop bag with a hole in the side, but uh, that is so random. Just too bad. They might be good. I'll test them out. Who knows? But I'm um, looking, looking like we have a couple things in here. Okay, not too bad. SmackDown vs. Raw 2008, the manual for the game. That's the sleeve for the game. That's pretty cool. This is looking interesting. Looks like it's all folded up, though. Ghost Recon, the new one. This is Tom Clancy's Ghost Recon Breakpoint, October 4th. That is a really cool piece of promo right there. Now, this promotional piece, this is stuff you really can't buy. It even says GameStop on the bottom. Just a really, really cool piece. I do like this. Sadly, it was folded like that. You can see the fold marks in it, but that's still really cool. I'm keeping that. That is actually really awesome. If I can slide it back there. There we go. That is just cool. I like it. And what is this one? There's another one, it looks like. This is get 850 Minecraft mine coins with any Minecraft merch or video game purchase. That's kind of neat. Uh, I'm not sure if I'm going to keep that one, but it's still pretty neat. Bottle in here. Some more gift cards. Always keep these. You never know if you can find money on them. You never ever know. Seems like a lot of papery kind of goods in this one, like a ton of paperweight. Yeah, look at this paper stuff. We have, looks like Apex Legends. That is. Oh, that's cool too. What? These are so cool. Nice. Now, I know you can go out and buy posters and things like that, but to find something like this, this and that, you can't find those. You can't actually buy these kinds of things. They're on thicker kind of cardboard. They're not actually like poster paper. Paper. I don't know why I said that weird, but paper. And these are really cool. Like, if you like the game, it's even cooler. They're just cool because you can't buy them. That's why I really like stuff like this. That is also a keeper. I'm keeping that. I played that game for a little bit, and I was actually really good at it. I'm not going to lie. <laughs> but, uh... Yeah, I was pretty good at it, but I kind of stopped playing. I kind of just didn't feel the interest of playing it anymore, even though it's still a good game. Recommend it. But uh, let's see what else we have. Some more gift cards. I think that's going to be it. Not seeing much else in the bottom of this bag. So I'm going to throw all these little papery scraps all up in here, and I'm going to recap what was found tonight. So first things first, it's a really smelly NBA 2K18 case. I'm not sure if I'm going to keep it. Maybe I can clean it up. It just smells really gross. I don't know. Uh, there's an Apex Legends, a little poster, which is pretty neat. I like that. Also, a Tom Clancy's one as well, which is for Ghost Recon Breakpoint. New game that hasn't even come out yet. Red Dead 2 with the map. Sadly, the case is all broken, but the map's in really good condition, which is awesome. An empty Assassin's Creed PS4 case. Call of Duty Black Ops 4 is empty as well. Sadly, not a single game tonight, but hey, you can't have jackpots every night. There's also a manual here for SmackDown vs. Raw, yeah, as well as... Oh, that's a sleeve. This is the manual. A bunch of gift cards. I got a ton of gift cards tonight. Star Wars, not in there. Ghost Recon, not in there. So two re Ghost Recon things. That's pretty cool. Tomb Raider sleeve that goes over the game. And Xbox one elite controller which the new gen 2 i believe was announced which is pretty cool a couple batteries that may or may not work 25 cents which is legit money 
And that is wrapping up tonight's Dumpster Dive. Thank you guys so, so much for watching. If you enjoyed, make sure to smack that like button. Can we get to 5,000 likes on tonight's video? I'd really appreciate it. And also remember, that's an entry into the giveaway. I will be leaving the last video over here. My Rubber Band Squad merch. Yeah, this right here, over here. Go check out the Rubber Band Squad merch if you want to help support the channel. Also, I will be leaving the Speedy Gamer if you guys want to subscribe over there. If you like gaming videos and subscribe to the Speedy Diver because you have to be a subscriber to win the giveaway. So thank you guys so much for watching. I love making these videos. Come back tomorrow for another epic video, and I'll catch you guys on the flip side.